There we go. Well, hello, everybody. It's Wendy Guth, founder of Rebel on the Go Travel, and I'm really excited to be here today with Kate Almgren, who is the uh, National Accounts Manager for GoGo -Go Vacations, which is a virtuoso preferred supplier and really an agent only, um, you got an agent only supplier because you don't sell to the the, the, I guess the real world. <laughs> Correct. Right. We don't sell to the real world. We only sell to <laughs> travel agents. Have a, since 1951. Oh, wow. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. yeah. And I can say that uh, working with GoGo -Go Vacations is absolutely amazing because I am able to then curate some amazing and actually sometimes it's hotels sometimes it's more of a, a package but anyway some really amazing opportunities that i otherwise would not have anyway so i'm very excited to have kate here today the theme as many of you know for me this month um and can you believe november it's, it's early november already it's just a little scary but anyway um that I, I, yeah, <laughs> and that the whole uh, holiday season started November 1st. Uh, yes, apparently. Uh, yes, right. it did. Yes. But for travel, that's not bad because, you know, my thing is give the gift of travel. So um, I'm excited to hear the thoughts of an expert. Um, and, but I first off would really love um, for Kate just to, Hey, can you just like introduce yourself? <laughs> I know, I'm, aren't I lazy to not do that? For <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, just to kind of tell us your story. All right. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Um, as Wendy said, my name is Kate Ombrin, and I am a national account manager with GoGo -Go Vacations, which, yes, we only work with travel agents, advisors, whatever you want to call them these days. Um, so we thank Wendy and her gifted travel network and Virtuoso for all of their support. Absolutely. Uh, a little bit about me. I actually started as a travel agent in 1994, working in a brick and mortar office and then um, worked my way up through agency management and almost two years ago moved over to GoGo -Go Vacations. And for me, coming from the agency side, it was a no brainer to work for a company that only supports our travel community. So thank you, Wendy, for giving me this opportunity to talk about the gift of travel. Absolutely, there is nothing better than the gift of travel. So I'm excited as well. Thank you for having me. Yay. And yeah. yeah, I actually did not know that about you, that you had started at, well, as an agent. That's, mm -hmm. yeah, actually that adds so, that adds like so much street cred. <laughs> right? Oh, it does. Actually, yes. I think a lot of go-go um, that I've come across, a lot of uh, your people, I mm -hmm. think actually come from the agent side. It's that? kind of a natural progression, you know, yeah. or they've just been consultants for so long that they essentially sure. are an agent, right? Like when we say, let us be your travel advisor, it's exactly what they are. Yeah. They, so they're selling travel to you, just like you're selling to your clients. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So this overarching theme this month, um, what do you, you know, what do you think or what comes to mind when you hear, you know, travel makes a, makes a great gift, mm -hmm. um, you know, with your background and yeah, I would love, I'd love to know, I'd love some, um, you know, some credibility for my own, what I'm doing. <laughs> You know, and well, and it does. Actually, I'll tell you. So our company, I don't know if you're, you're aware, GoGo is actually owned by Flight Center, which is a large Australian company. Um, and we have our America's side, but a lot of the Australian things are starting to trickle here. And one of them that we have is, um, like, now I can't think of what it's actually called. It's terrible. Um, but it always happens on Wednesdays, of like basically waste-free Wednesdays. Oh. And so it just so happened that the theme today was thinking about Christmas and things that you can do to be waste free. So instead of using wrapping paper and buying toys and electronics and things that are going to end up in landfills, what better thing to give than to give the gift of travel? Oh, so you're on the same page apparently, right? Because travel is so meaningful to everyone. So, you know, yes, give travel, whether it be a weekend in New York or a week in Paris. You know, there's something for everyone when it comes to travel and especially people with families and children or grandchildren. We're seeing so much of the multi-gen 
mm -hmm. coming what a perfect way to take a multi-gen trip is to give that as your christmas present and then everyone has something to remember forever but not only are we helping our environment we're building better family memories so oh, exactly. double whammy exactly i love it that's fabulous yes are, are you seeing any hot spots just out of curiosity for multi-gen uh trips right now it's really still focused in caribbean and mexico i think it's just easy with the all-inclusives for it yes. um, to really go through that way but it really actually virtuoso their study the multi-gen travel their number one destination is london and paris or destinations so mm -hmm. people are really starting to take younger and younger kids across mm -hmm. the pond yep. um but it's great i mean why not get these kids used to traveling yeah They're well, our I packed up my kids last year and we did just that. Did did actually not London to Paris. So yeah, that's yeah. Yeah. And uh what I'm seeing and actually and you cover a very wide well, you cover the whole world. <laughs> Almost the whole world. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. We don't do Africa and we don't do South America. Okay. We do bits of everywhere else in the world. Yeah. Okay. Wow. That's a pretty big that's pretty big. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wow. And have you been, have you been everywhere? <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had been everywhere. I know. Actually, we need to implement the same thing in our household with uh, travel instead of, instead of presents. Yeah. There we have more know. places. We have a long list of places to go. So I think New York is next and then someone's talking about Paris. So we'll see what happens. Oh, wow. Cause you're on the West coast. Yes. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Cause I, I, when I think, you know, Oh, New York, I'm like, Oh, you just hop on the train and you'll be there in 10 minutes and or no. we get up on the plane and be there in five and a half hours. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. 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 Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. That's uh yeah. And that's a great, actually, that's a wonderful place with kids, especially when they're a little older. Uh, it can oh yeah. Yes. Yes. Um, so I'd love to know, you know, I get, so, when I think about um, travel, especially at the holiday time, it's definitely the multi-gen. Um, mm -hmm. It's also like couples. The big thing I'm finding right now is couples traveling together, which is probably, it's not a new thing, um, but I, it just seems to be happening like more and more. And, and also definitely like the girls getaways. So I would love to share how, um, or ask you to share how, you know, go, go vacations can create these kinds of adventures because I know, <laughs> but again, it had some more credibility when it comes from you. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, it, and it's definitely something that we do. And there's quite a few of our partners that mm -hmm. help us out with that. So that's, you know, basically how it works is that we have our preferred partners. So mm -hmm. when you say holidays and families, the first thing that pops to mind is Grand Bellas. Um, they're amazing when it comes to holidays, you know, everything's decked out and they decorate and they have activities that they do for the kids. They have a Santa. So <laughs> it's really, it's all about who we partner with to make mm -hmm. the experience experiences but of course the side where we make it easier for you is that since we have those connections we can put it all together so whether it comes to you know the girls weekend where they're going to need a little private space to have a cocktail party or the multi-gen where they want their rooms to connect or be in the same sections mm -hmm. that's really where we come in and make it easier for you yes. and pull them all together flights transfers all of that oh. yeah and actually um I know I, I have a client who's going to be going to Jamaica, what, two weeks, two weeks. And, um, uh, when I was speaking with my go, go person, uh, Leah and, um, we love, love her. Leah. So, <laughs> yes. all love Leah. Yeah. She's like, Oh, well, you know, we can also include, you know, a special waiting area at the airport and a yes. special this and a special that. And, and, and it, it actually makes it, so unbelievably smooth and so the knowledge is just absolutely tremendous to know that all these little pieces come together and absolutely. absolutely yeah and or you know this is the tower you want to be in in this particular it's like wow right, right. Or, and those are the things you don't necessarily know doing it on your own you know you look at a resort and you don't understand what the difference is between this garden tower and this garden tower this partial ocean tower what exactly does that mean as opposed to this ocean tower so exactly. yes. and have the guidance 
Exactly. And as you and I were talking before, um, you know, sandals is, is, is really a huge thing, especially for couples. And uh, actually, I, I currently have a proposal for, for a honeymoon. Um, and, you know, when, you, when I looked at all the pieces and, and the proposal that puts together, not only does it come in less expensive than if you did it yourself, correct? There's no, there's no hassle. And, and right. it's not just that, and it really it ultimately is there's no hassle for the clients, for the consumers who are going there. It's just absolutely, yeah. That's, That's the idea, right? No hassle for you, no hassle for your clients. Let's just make it streamlined, one-stop shopping, everything you need for everyone. Absolutely. And especially those multi-gen, they start looking into groups and yeah. things that get even larger. That yeah. can be so complicated when trying to deal with a hotel. So yeah. much easier. Yes. Yes. And yeah. our group's yeah. department is amazing. They can handle all of it. Yes. Just yeah. get everything done. Even weddings. I mean, if you've got a wedding group that needs to go, we can put mm -hmm. you in charge with or in touch with the coordinator. Once mm -hmm. we get you booked, set up the wedding package, do everything all in one stop much, much easier than trying to do that on your own. Yes. Oh, there is absolutely no question. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah. My background yeah, is meetings and events and I completely understand what you're saying. Yes. So how many, how many properties are, you know, do you, it, how many properties I guess are in your inventory? There's over 18,000 properties across the world. Wow. Oh, wow. And, mm -hmm. and many of them are virtuoso um, hotels. Many of them are virtuoso hotels. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And mm -hmm. there's even some of those that will pass through virtuoso amenities. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good. I didn't even have to put you on the spot to ask. Ah, see, <laughs> uh, <yeah>. out. Yes. <laughs> virtuoso <laughs> amenities. Right. As long as the go, go vacations, my time amenities, which are exclusive to us. So very similar oh. to virtuoso amenities in a way, okay. um, and that they come with private check-in areas, upgrade upon arrival if available, uh, an amenity, on-site amenity or credit. So sometimes we can double those with the virtuoso benefits. Other times they'd apply to properties that may not offer a virtuoso amenity. So oh, a nice little addition. Yeah. And, and applies on groups. Yeah. Oh, that's, yeah. oh, that's fabulous. That really yes. is fabulous. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. I have, I'm, I'm looking at uh, Costa Rica in mm -hmm. May for a group that, yes, yeah, oh, and actually the hotel, oh, wow, why can't, Mayara, Mayara, anyway, it came up as being like the third best hotel in like the Americas, and I was like, I want that. Right. Yes, please. I want to stay somewhere. Talk about the gift of travel. Yes. Exactly. Yes, please. Yeah. Exactly. 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 Oh, so, uh, yeah. And I think we've talked a bit about it, but yeah, the relationship with, you know, the, the travel advisors, you're really just such an extension of our offices. And therefore, I think of it that our clients, you know, have, we've now opened up our resources Absolutely. so vastly and offered, it, it just, it, it just soups up what we can do for our clients, which is just uh, pretty amazing. I think. Correct. Yeah. And that's, yeah, that's exactly right. And that's, that's what we want to do for you is to say, not only are we an extension of you, which is why we're open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. So we can be there for you all the time. I know it sounds exhausting, but there's certain people that do that. <laughs> and well, we, we want you to not work all the time as well. So that applies if your clients are traveling and they need to reach out for some reason, then they have right. access. So, you know, it really does make it a little more streamlined, but just one way we make everybody's life easier. Wow. Yes. And hey, thank you very much. You're welcome. Absolutely. <laughs> tell you on weekends, especially. Yeah. Cause you know, in the age of the cell phone, we're, you know, we're all, uh, kind of, you know, yeah, we very much live in the 24 24 seven. Seven. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Exactly. So, I would love to know. So what's your favorite, what's the favorite go-go vacation that you've taken? Ooh, that's like putting me on the spot. I have to pick up. Oh, I know. Sorry. Oh, you're mean. <laughs> I know. You know, and I, I have yet to find a favorite favorite. And the only reason for me is because every place new always turns into somewhere else that's favorite, right? So we have a rule in our family that you can't go the same place twice. Oh, um, wow. 
Right. Because there's so many places yeah. to see. So if you, you know, you can't. Now I will say the one place we will break that rule for is Maui. So oh. of all the places in the world, I know. And I actually know a couple other people that feel the same way, but there's just some magic of Maui that does something for you. So mm. I would have to say at this point, since that, that is the one rule breaker, that would have to be the favorite. But otherwise, they're all so amazing. I mean, every place is so different, right? You're going to get something completely different in Thailand than you're going to get in Europe. You're going to get something completely different in the Caribbean than you're going to get in Mexico. So, yeah. yeah. yeah no, that's, that is very All of them. They're all favorites. We love them all. <laughs> I know. Good answer. <laughs> it's true. I can't, I can't help it. No, yeah. no, no, no. And I can understand. Yeah. Never been a vacation I don't like. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, actually, and that's very true. It's very hard to compare St. Martin to Iceland, just except that they're both islands. Right. Did that's where it stops. Part? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> so, yeah. So Topical. it's good to have multiple oh. sites of where you go. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I really, really appreciated you coming on and chatting. I'm just very excited Anytime. about um, what what uh i with go go vacations is able to do um for gifting these tra this travel for the holiday season and i'm excited to be able to showcase um over the next week or so um different different options that are available you know a lot of times people just don't think about it or they really um, they sort of, you know, it's like leading to water, meaning mm -hmm. I don't Absolutely. think about where do I, you know, where do I want to go with my daughter? I don't think about it. So we won't go anywhere. Uh, right. or, uh, that kind of thing. So it, I, I see my mission. <laughs> That's right. That's my, right. I'm leading the charge that says, well, there are so many different options. So, and I'm excited to showcase um, a number of things, uh, including, uh, including like multi-generational. What did I see the, the Rubens at the palace in London, because who doesn't want to be in view of the queen? Right. I do. I do. I do. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> or exactly. yeah, I mean, couples who like to golf Maui. <laughs> yes. And if you 100%. don't like golf and you want to ditch the golfers, oh my gosh, everything else about Maui is amazing. And, you know, and yeah, like who doesn't want to go to a spa resort in Costa Rica? It's, I do. Right. Me? I know. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Oh my God. To the third best or third nicest resort in the Right. Which means it also has a spa, right? So we can go do like a, uh, Test run, spot. Exactly. Right. exactly. Oh, yeah. I, I, my bags will be packed. <laughs> <laughs> and the beauty is, hey, you guys can also help with the airfare, which is a some, which is yes. huge, absolutely right. huge, also because sightseeing excursions. Yeah, you, you, you know, if you decide you want to go zip lining while you're in Costa Rica, you um, can do that too. Or look at sloths. Or, or look at sloths. <laughs> or look at sloths. Yes, <laughs> which is probably a little more like. So yeah, I'll walk to the okay. zip lining. Okay, I would be, I, I actually, that has made my bucket list of something that I have to strive to do. Okay. Zip lining. Yeah, we're going to yeah. work that. Yeah. I did it. <laughs> and yeah, I didn't want to, um, but now I would probably do it again. So oh, it, it's out of the list. That yeah. is the other rule with travel is that when you're traveling on a trip, you must do something that you wouldn't normally do. Exactly. 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 Otherwise, yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. Whether it's trying a food or doing zip lining or something involving ocean, yeah. something that you would out of your comfort zone that you wouldn't do in normal life, you must do while you're traveling. Oh, I love that. That's great. And then you proceed to be able to talk about it till the next trip. That's right. And you never know what it might open up for you. I mean, that's the point, right? Exactly. Exactly. Oh, wow. You're speaking my language. All <laughs> right. Perfect. Good. So, okay. So yes, thank you so much. And I always like to end interviews with a little bit. Do you remember, um, what was it? Uh, the guy who did uh, the actors, the actors lab or something where anyway, this, he would ask the questions. He'd say, you know, he'd say something at the end, the first thing that pops into your mind. And I ruined it because I can't remember the show or the guy's name. Anyway, <laughs> All right. We're just going to pretend and we're going to go with it. Yeah. Pretend, and I'm just going to say something. And just the first thing that pops into your mind. Okay. Road trips. Oh boy. <laughs> 
Uh, I can elaborate, but. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I love that. It leaves. No, I think road trips are great. They are another way <laughs> to see, you yeah. know, and that's, yeah. I don't think we do enough of them, honestly, but there is always an oh boy with road trips. Okay. And see, I can picture uh, once again, a road trip in Costa Rica. <laughs> oh, that would definitely be an oh boy. Yeah. The roads there. Yes. 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 Um, how about, um, mixing business with pleasure? Why not? Exactly. Oh, right. and just for the listeners, we actually just got back from the same cruise <laughs> that we were both on yes. uh, Celebrity Summit. Yes, yes. Definitely yes. mixing business with pleasure. Oh, yes, yes. yes. And actually, and, we, and I think that goes along with the whole wellness of mind and work in that if it's all work and no play, you're not as likely to absorb and enjoy as much as if you have that balance. We need, you know, we all work so hard. There must be some work-life balance. Exactly. So if you put the two together yeah. in some sort of a trip with, you know, whether it be your colleagues or others, why not? That's exactly. exactly. Yeah, absolutely. Exactly. Exactly. Because that's where they say that's, that's where the synergy that's where magic happens. Where that's right. You get the various sections of your brain firing at all different times. And yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> good for your heart. It's good for your mind. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So, and this one always is my favorite. Travel like your life depends on it. Ooh, I love that. I love that. I'd actually not heard that before, but yes, if that doesn't make you think about where you want to go and what you need to do, I mean, life's so short. You just never know. I love it. Love it. It's a great way to bring out the passion and travel. Yeah. Yeah. Well, again, thank you so much, so much for, for joining me today and to everyone out there in uh, cyber world. I will see you all very very soon. <laughs> Bye. Thank you, Wendy. It was a pleasure.